Welcome to DIYEasyCrafts.com. Today we're going to take a look at how to make a very inexpensive, portable, outboard motor stand. Now this stand was designed to be used with uh, any standard hand truck. The bottom two cross members that the truck slides under are actually raised up a little bit from the uprights. So the hand truck slides under it easily. This project is very easy. Cut list tells you exactly what pieces you have to use. Um, I used the 2x10 just because I had uh, some scrap around, but you could use you know, two 2x4s, two you could use a 2x6 or a 2x8 for that 22 and a half inch piece. Uh, the rest are all done out of 2x4s. With the two 30 inch pieces cut uh, with 45s on both ends. And then we're going to screw the whole thing together uh, with a combination of uh, three inch and two and a half inch screws. And one more image. This shows you where each one of those pieces fits. You could always just pause the video and, and take a better look at that image. So again, we're going to screw each of the pieces together. This is the uh, two by 10, uh, the top piece being mounted onto the two uprights. I did pre-drill the holes, uh, just so that I wouldn't get any cracking close to the edges. I, I marked about a quarter inch up uh, to, to put that bottom rail in. This is, it's gonna be kept off of the floor so that the uh, hand truck can slide underneath it a little easily. Uh, in the future, if I did this again, I would probably make it a half inch rather than a quarter. Now this is the box frame that's actually going to support the stand. So it's um, one 25 and a half inch piece being attached to two 22 and a half inch pieces. And that's also going to get screwed right onto those two uprights. There's no fancy carpentry going on here. This was a, you know, literally a 10 or a 15 minute build uh, just because I needed, I needed one. Uh, these are the two uh, 30 inch pieces. They have 45s cut on both ends. Gonna screw those in place. You could, you could make something similar with different dimensions. Uh, you could use two by threes rather than two by fours. You know, you could make one of these to hold two outboards and just make it wider. So the original design was to, to have the hand truck kind of fit in between the two uprights. Uh, but when I tried it out with the outboard, it, it turned out that the, that the outboard uh, control arm uh, actually interfered with the hand truck. So I was forced to uh, place two additional um, rails on the back of the stand. I just added two 2x4s, you know, one up top and one on the bottom, um, and that gives a little bit of clearance. The hand truck actually rides right on those rails now. So it slides right under those bottom two, which are raised a little bit. And now I can use the hand truck to, to easily move this outboard around. So when th this is a, a 25 horsepower. Um, I turn it to the side, I raise the control arm. Slide the hand truck underneath. And I'm ready to go. It's also designed so that there's enough room underneath it that you could put a, a five gallon bucket um, you know, on, a, on a stand so that you can winterize this or run it in the bucket. A very easy, very affordable, I think it only took three two by fours and a, a few screws to put this together. 
I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, I ask that you please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this YouTube channel. I'd like to give you an invite to join us on the web at DIYEasyCrafts.com where you can find a variety of how-to projects. Thank you very much.